good morning, and thank you for joining our Daily Outlook. And today, we'll cover the changes in the dollar-yen pair. Greg will be sharing insights from our trading desk. The oil-dollar pair rose 0.9% in the last session. The stochastic indicator is giving a negative signal. The pound-dollar pair made a minor upwards correction in the last session, gaining 0.2%. The Williams indicator indicates an overbought market. The Bitcoin dollar pair exploded 1.6% in the last session. The stochastic indicator is giving a negative signal. The last session saw the gold gain 0.5% against the dollar. The stochastic RSI is giving a negative signal. Moving on to world financial news. The Pepe price rose to a record high, a surge driven by the recent approval of key Ether exchange-traded fund filings in the US, prompting traders to view Ethereum-based meme coins as high-risk, high-reward opportunities. Gold prices jumped 1% higher after a two-week low hit in the previous session as investors assessed diminishing bets of US interest rate cuts ahead of a key inflation report due later this week. Canada's main stock index rose as higher commodity prices boosted resource shares and the market transitioned to a faster trade settlement standard, while investors looked ahead to bank earnings reports this week. Thank you for your insightful ideas. And now, let's review today's major economic events. The Eurozone's Eurogroup meeting will be released at 7 GMT. The US S&P Case-Shiller Home Price Indices at 13 GMT the US Consumer Confidence at 14 GMT. Australia's retail sales will be released at 1.30 GMT. The US Red Book Index at 12.55 GMT. Germany's Wholesale Price Index at 6 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day.